Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in to Metaphysically Me. This is Shannon from MetaphysicallyMe.com and you are watching the Daily Oracle Card Reading for August the 9th, 2013. And um, as a reminder, please, um, please submit your videos for uh, the intuitive messages from afar slash spirit guide drawing by uh, August the 25th. Um, to enter in the contest of course and uh, for more uh, information on that please check it out on metaphysicallyme.com or right here on my youtube channel so yeah let's go into the reading and today i'm still drawing from the john holland or i mean the john holland tarot card deck excuse me y'all I'm all over the place I'm getting tongue-tied. So, yeah, the John Holland Oracle Card deck. I'm still, I don't know why I'm still drawn to this deck, but I do feel like um, I need to work with it for a few more days. So, um, let's see what card I have pulled for today. Okay, today's card is Stand Your Ground, and it's the number seven card. Now, um... As I tune into this, I'm being uh, shown the the destiny card. It's funny how lately I have been t taken back to the card previously, um, previous the previous card, excuse me, um, to see how it ties into the card that we have for today. And so yesterday's card was the Destiny's card. And I felt like then that um, you still had to do some initiation to get the Wheel of Destiny to start moving. And this card is uh, more confirmation for that. I feel like we're still just standing around and saying, and, and like, you know how Double Dutch and the two ropes are swinging and then the kid is sitting on the side and they're like, I'm jumping in, I'm jumping in, I'm jumping in, you know, and they just rocking get before they jump in like I'm going no, I'm not going I'm going I'm not going well this is the same um, feeling that I'm getting is that we know what to do but instead of us just doing it to get the wheel of destiny going that um, we're just not doing anything we're not making a choice and so this is a reminder that it's time to stand your ground and to stand up for what you believe in. I don't care if nobody understands where you're coming from. I don't care if you don't understand where you're coming from. If it's something that you know that in your gut that you need to do, and you know what I'm talking about when we get them gut feelings, because it keeps coming up around, keeps coming back up. So your your guides put you in places where people are talking about that particular subject or you watch a TV and that particular subject keeps coming up this is confirmation that stand your ground keep your beliefs firm okay because when you do that other people will start seeing that you're serious even if they don't believe in what you're doing okay so that is very important that we start standing our ground and as we start standing our ground guess what the light is going to slowly start coming in so that we will get clarity so that's what I'm getting this light means clarity and this to me is moving out of the way so that we can see all of this as as this Sun or light um, part down here because I'm feeling like this is the Sun and I feel like something's blocking the Sun and so when this moves out the way we'll definitely get to see the few the full picture so keep that in mind um, today just um, take baby steps like I want everybody to sit down and, and write a list out of the things that they know they can do or the things that they feel like they need to do to accomplish the goal that they need to make I don't care if it's fixing a relationship or starting a business or you know getting a routine I need you to just sit down and really focus on the things that will make you um, embrace um, this idea or to bring this idea into fruition so that's today's reading and um, I hope this resonates with you if it does please leave a comment down below um, if you if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do if you have thank you so much um, like I said uh, continue to shine your lights bright because uh, one light can lead the way for one person or it can lead the way for a thousand people so, um, yeah.
Go to metaphysicallyme.com to check out the monthly reading and the online store. As always, I'm Metaphysically Me, and I hope you're metaphysically you. Have a good day.